how to program the receipt header on your Sharp XEA217 cash register. First of all, you need to remove the main keyboard overlay so that you've got the alpha keyboard overlay enabling you to type in your new receipt header. Then we need to go into the program mode. To do this, press mode and then scroll down to line 6, PGM mode. When this is highlighted, press the TLNS button, then scroll down to setting, TLNS, and then you need to scroll through the main setting menu for line 10 message. When highlighted, press TLNS and press TLNS again to go into receipt logo. You're now looking at what will currently appear on your receipt message. So we're going to program line one to be shop stuff. So we're going to delete what's currently on there. The delete button is next to the number nine. So we're going to blank line. We want it to appear in caps. So we press the caps button. Well, you know you're in caps when the A is highlighted at the bottom. And we're also for the top couple of lines, we're going to use double size. So you press the DC button here and you get a W appear there. So that means you're in double size characters. On the 217, you have six lines of receipt logo message and each line can have up to 24 normal size characters or 12 characters if you've got the double size activated. When you're ready you simply type in what you want to appear on the line by simply pressing the letters on the keyboard. So there we have shop stuff. When we're happy with that we can scroll down to line 2 and then use the arrow across button to go back to the start of the line and then again delete what's already there so we've got a clean line to start with we'll now put in our phone number we're still in double size and caps so we T you have some punctuation up here so we can press that and then put it in a space which is here for the numbers numbers you simply enter them by pressing them on the 0 to 9 keypad Just enough room for them by the looks of it. Again, we save that by coming down. We scroll back to the start of the line. Delete what's already there. And then now I've pressed the DC button, so we've deactivated the double size. So we can now put in, I don't know if you wanted to put in perhaps a line of address or a website that might be more than 12 characters, you could now type this in. So we've got www. The dot is here, and to activate that, you need to press the Shift button first. And then we go back to the normal characters. Again, to get the full stop, we press Shift and then the button where the full stop is and then co shift full stop UK once you're happy with that you can then if you decide I'm only going to have a free line receipt header you could now delete the remaining lines or if you want six lines at the top that's fine you can carry on programming but basically you enter the characters all on here you might need the shift button to enter some of the punctuation and then for double size you have the DC button you have a space button here your delete buttons there and then remember if you want it to appear in caps for the whole line you need to press the caps button at the start when you're ready to save whatever you've got you press TLNS and then the escape cancel button until you return back to the main total screen. Thanks for watching.